Boy, were you right. That's gold, dude. <laughs> yeah. 14 carat. <laughs> What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. I am currently in my car. I was just outside, but it started to downpour on me and I cannot afford another camera right now. So we had to move it into the car. This week's video is all about finding treasure. We went to a flea market and found some good stuff. We're at the Columbus flea market, the biggest flea market. Last time I came here, I got vintage Versace sunglasses. Check these out. I got these here, so I'm hoping to get some good finds. Let's see what we can get. The main rule of haggling is the person who names the price always loses. Let them put out the first price. So say, what do you want for this item? Yeah, even if there's a price tag on it. <laughs> All right, so this is what you do. I'll bring out two items. One's the decoy, one's the real. Okay, this lady knows what she's doing. Don't be scared. I'm nervous. Don't be scared. Give my love 15 or two for 25. 15 or two for 25. Is there any way you would do 10 on this one? Thank you. I appreciate that because I'm running out of money here. <laughs> <laughs> Told I was running out of money. I got money. <laughs> What's the story on these glasses again, my friend? Elvis wore them. Give them to me for a dollar. <laughs> Thank you. Have a good day. All right, buddy. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Babe, we can't get a bird. No birds. Or? They're talking now. Order. No, but I heard her saying something. Damn, Brody. I see you. Should I ask him how much for the WRX? So my brother Mark haggled for that grenade. I don't know why he needs a grenade, but he got one. I got Elvis's sunglasses. I know Elvis didn't actually wear the sunglasses, but they were a dollar and the guy was funny enough to make that story. So I bought the sunglasses. Why not? We didn't get the bird, but I did find something else insanely cool. I found Honda Accord Type R accessories. If you don't know what a Type R is, it's like the race car that Honda makes. This is the Accord version. Check these out. These are retro. So these are seatbelt pads for the Honda Accord Type R. You put them on your seatbelt like right here and uh, it doesn't choke you out and it adds some protection I guess and it just adds some aesthetic. I don't have a Honda Accord but my buddy does so I'm gonna give them to him. Actually what the? Hold on wait he's actually right here. Yo! What the fuck? So he just pulled up. Yo! What are the chances that you just pull up right now before you see what I got for you? My buddy that just pulled up has a Honda Accord, a nice, it is stock though. You're gonna have to, you're gonna have to mess with it, my friend. But I, I got something for you. I went to the flea market the other day. I got something for you. Oh. You know what those are? Yeah. They're a little crusty. They're definitely used. Yeah, yeah a little crusty. But so that, like, huh? Mustard yellow. But so, <laughs> so the Accord Type R is like the car that your car is going to look like soon enough. <laughs> and these are yours, my friend. I appreciate right. it. No problem, bro. All right, peace. <laughs> what are the chances that Tub rolls by in the exact moment that I, that I talk about the gift that I was going to give him? He's got the Honda Accord, so he gets the Honda Accord accessories. But that's not all. We also went to the. You've been hacked. That was very creepy. Well. I feel very uncomfortable. <laughs> So my best friend Fotini and my girlfriend Milena took my camera while I was at work and they wanted to do a little contest on who knows me more. So they made questions and they answered them and I will decide who has the correct answer or who is more close to being correct. How old was Dom when he had his first kiss? Mm. Do you even know It that? probably was in fifth grade, you should have seen him then. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. That was fucked up. Is this gonna just be a roast session on me? Cause I hope not. 16. <laughs> I think Dom had his first kiss when he was 14. Wrong. My first kiss was actually in fifth grade on the school bus with Sierra Howell. Way back in the day. She was a nice girl. <laughs> but congratulations, you're both wrong. What is Dom's favorite drink? What it's color seltzer? Black cherry. No way. Yes it is. Black cherry. Um, it's definitely the lime seltzer. You're both wrong again. My favorite beer would be Corona. My favorite regular drink would be wild cherry Pepsi, but I don't drink soda anymore, so I don't drink it. But that is my favorite drink. It is delicious. Wild cherry Pepsi. How old was Dom <laughs> when he learned to drive stick shift? 23. I'm gonna now. go 23 and a half. 
No, you can't do that. <laughs> this one's a little bit more hard. When I lived in California for a little bit, for transportation, I had to drive my buddy's Audi, and unfortunately, it was stick shift. Uh, I never really learned, and I think I broke his car like 12 times, so... That's the first time I drove stick shift, but I perfected my stick shift driving when I was 23 years old and bought my brand new 2018 Subaru Impreza. So, I would say you're both right on that. Congratulations. What would be Dom's idea of a perfect date? His idea of a perfect date is waking up early, me cooking him some pork roll, <laughs> some breakfast, making him a coffee, oh my holding his camera and recording <laughs> his whole day with the camera. We'll do something fun because he always like likes to do something that I want to do, but we'll do record everything and we'll have good footage and then at the end of the night, I'll lay next to him while he edits. That's yeah. his idea of a perfect night. How long does he edit for? Hours. That's not fun? a date though. It is a date. A date so you is guys on dates every day? Yes. We have it to me in my heart. <laughs> Bullshit. Does she count those as dates? I'm just, I'm just messing. She, what she said is awesome and it's very honest. And yes, I love spending days like that. And she is the best sport when it comes to supporting me and what I want to do and I'm very thankful for that. I can't explain how grateful I am to have that support in my life. But the truth is when I can take her out on a date, on a real date, I do because she deserves much more than she thinks she does. Thank you, baby. But you're both wrong. What is Dom's favorite food? Steak. <laughs> His favorite food is definitely not steak. It's pizza. Wrong again. My favorite food is mozzarella sticks, but steak is a close second. So Milena would be closer on that one. How old was Dom when he lost his virginity? <laughs> I think Damn. he was 17. 17. <gasps> I really but, but he, wasn't then he was like getting no. any? No. Uh, yeah, he's 17. Getting. 17? No. <laughs> what do you mean he's always getting? With Are who? you kidding me? Did you see Dom? It's, you didn't see Dom when he started transforming. Wait, my question is, what do you mean he used to get always get some? I mean, you were like, because he wasn't getting any. And I was like, he always gets some. Like, I was just... Um, <laughs> right, I gotta... We need to talk to you. <laughs> All right, well, thanks for that, Fotini. However, I'm not going to answer that question. Stupid question, personal question, no need to answer it. So, I guess my best friend and my girlfriend don't know me as well as they thought they did. I don't know how to feel about that. Huh. Then, we went lake metal detecting, and things went pretty well. I got my GoPro, my goggles, we're gonna find some treasure.
Boy, were you right. Are they earring? Ring? That's gold, dude. Yeah. 14 carat. <laughs> we had a good day, honestly. If you saw my last metal detecting video, it didn't go too well, but we did find a silver ring with some diamonds in it. You can check that out right here. But this time, we found some stuff. If you lost this wedding band in the Medford area, contact me and I will give this back to you. So currently we know we have the 14 carat gold wedding band and also we have these diamond earrings. We don't know if the diamonds are real, but we did order a diamond tester. So as soon as that comes in, I will update update you guys on if the diamonds are real or not. I am super excited for the diamond tester to come in. Me and my buddy washed our cars this week, so uh, we got some pretty cool footage of that. 